Hi and welcome. It's Megan here. Today I'm going to be vlogging a little day in my life. So if you like these kind of videos, definitely give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. So let's get into it. I finally got dressed. I'll show you guys my outfit in a second. I'm just putting on some perfume. And I'm doing my Florian till Vanilla again. It's still my favorite. I'm gonna have to buy some more eventually. Mm. <coughs> oh, I didn't show y'all my perfume stand. Let me do that. Isn't it so cute? I just love it. And then I realized I had a sample of the Carolina Herrera perfume um, in like, in this 25 days of beauty box that I got from Macy's. So here are like all the products. I realized I never opened them. It's an advent calendar. So I was supposed to open one each day. And so I'm going to try these products over the next couple of days, but or the next couple of weeks. But that's the perfume stand that I got from Amazon. And I honestly love it. And I love the little perfume. Uh, this one, the heel. And I'm like, I need to buy more perfume going to brunch and it's cold, right? But I saw this kind of look on Pinterest where you have like the oversized sweater or a cute sweater, the satin skirt, and then they put it with combat boots. And you know, it's not normally how I would dress, but it's growing on me slowly. Uh, I think the sweater is from TJ Maxx. The skirt is either Shein or Amazon and then the boots are Steve Madden. And so now jacket, they had one with like a shacket and then like a coat, like an all black coat. So I'm actually about to try both of those. Okay, so here it is with the shacket, um, which, you know, I like the kind of pop of color, you know? And you know, I like the shacket, but I'm still trying to decide for sure if I want the shacket. And then I also have the black jacket. So let me try that one on and you guys let me know which one you like. So here's the shacket, it's from Amazon. And then here it is with the black coat from Fashion Nova. I actually don't like the coat now that I have it on. I guess I'll take this purse. Let me call mom. She said to call her when I got dress. Does she mean FaceTime? I'm a FaceTimer and see. Is it ringing? There it goes. Is she not gonna answer? She told me to call her. Hi, Mom. I was like, you're not going to answer? I'm sorry. I had to bring her down. And I'm in here trying to get this thing back on this mattress. Okay, guys. I'm at Mom's house with the most amazing lighting. That's why I like coming over here. I'm going to get me a place, too, with a lot of lighting. But I got my Ancestry DNA thing. So I've had this for a while. I was supposed to, like, send in the sample a long time ago. So it's just been sitting here. So... I can finally do it now today. So I'm gonna open it up. It's got this stuff, which is, I guess, what you put the spit or saliva in, and then no post it necessary. He's sticking no, in this. Not I'm not adopted. <laughs> Maybe if we didn't look alike, Mom, really? Oh, yeah. <laughs> She's so crazy. All right, where the instructions at? There we go. Welcome to a whole new world of personal discoveries. So I can download the app or do it on the computer. And I guess you guys don't want to see me spit, so I'll let you know when I'm done. <laughs> but I'm setting this up and then when I'm done with this, we're gonna go to brunch. And I think we're trying to go to Big Bad Breakfast. Mm -hmm. Avondale, shake the tube for at least five seconds. One, two. Three, four, five. 
This will ensure your sample mixes thoroughly with our stabilizing solution so our lab can process your results. Place the tube in the collection bag. Okay. And then seal the adhesive. There we go. Mail in your sample. You know, like five months from now, I'll let you guys know where I'm months. from. <laughs> I'm so excited. It's been like six weeks, six to eight weeks. I don't know. I feel like it took forever. You were like, you were like, Meg, it's taking forever. I don't know when it's coming. Yeah. yeah. You track it. Though. So we're going to Avondale? Yeah. Avondale Common House. Common House. Uh, we couldn't go to, where did I want to go earlier? Big yeah. Bad? Big Bad Breakfast. Because the, the wait is two hours and 40 30 minutes. minutes. Yeah. 30 minutes. 30 minutes. 30 30 40 minutes two hours and 30 40 minutes um that was and they close at 2 30 and it's already almost it's 11 50 so if it's two hours and 40 minutes it would be basically when they're closed yeah and this one they close <laughs> at three and she said and it's only 45 minutes away oh okay that's Even fine now. waiting outside for a table so why you walk away oh I didn't know I was in it no, it don't matter it's fine it's fine I was thirsty you guys yeah thirsty it's been a couple of hours now me and mom went driving around looking at like uh like houses and apartments and stuff we didn't like do any tours or anything we we're just driving around and then uh we went back to her house and i took a nap of course because that's like the normal thing that i do and so now back at my place i'll probably clean up a little bit i've pulled up netflix to pick something to watch and i just finished ozark then you know i guess the first part of the fourth season that just came out it was only a couple episodes so i watched that in like a day or two and then this other show right here archive 81 have you guys seen this this was low-key very interesting it was a little creepy but it was really interesting. I watched that the other week. So sometimes these shows that are like in the top 10 are sometimes pretty good. 
What's that when all of us are dead? Oh, that's about the zombies. Nah, I don't want to do zombies. The woman in the house across the street from the girl in the window. That just seems like a long title. I think I'm going to watch that. All right, so I'm just heating up some leftovers of this like ground turkey kind of mixture thing that I made. So that's what I'm gonna eat for dinner. I'm getting a little tired. And so I changed into um, this sweatshirt and leggings just to kind of lounge some more. And then I also took my makeup off with a makeup wipe. But I've realized I've lost so many hours watching this show. Um, the girl across from the street looking out the window, the girl at the window looking across the street. I don't know. You guys know what I'm talking about. This show on Netflix with Kristen Bell in it. And the show is so weird. And like, I, I don't know how I feel about it. I Googled it and I realized it's a satire. So um, that makes me feel a little bit about it. Because at first I was just like, dang, these people are crazy. But you know, I won't ruin it or anything in case some people want to watch. But it's, a, it's different. The show is different. That's all I'm going to say. But I've watched almost most of it. It looks like I'm on episode six. So I've lost like five, six hours of my life like I do. And um, before I continue to lose more hours of my life, I am going to um, put this load of clothes away. I watched it like the other day, probably a week, maybe two weeks ago. So I'm gonna fold that stuff up and put some of those items away and then I wanna clean up my kitchen for when I go to sleep because I like my kitchen to be so clean when I wake up in the morning. So that was the end of this vlog today. I know it was a little short. I didn't really do much today, um, but I hope you enjoyed it anyway. If you did, definitely give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in my next one. Love you guys. Bye. Oh, you guys, I saw something moving in my room, like out the corner of my eye. And it's like my pompous grass. It's like, it's got like its shadow. And I just, I don't know. It just looked like there was like a monster in my room. Like I got so scared for a second. <laughs> but I think my ceiling fan is on in there. So it's blowing the pompous grass around me. <laughs> ah, oh my gosh. Yeah, now I can fully see it. Whoa, that like totally freaked me out. Anyway, um, I already said bye, but bye for real this time.